going on YouTube? Welcome back folks. Now if you've been watching these videos on this guitar, this is that 51 Squire. It's black. Talked about uh, a bunch of things. Painting the pick guard black. And well, actually that's what I did and I'll show it to you right now. Turned out really nice. It did, I think. There you can see what it looks like. The back side's still white. Now, there's a little bevel, talked about it before, right around, you can see it right there, I think, yes, I see it in the camera. And that bevel runs completely around the entire pit guard there, I think you can see it. It's still black. I thought about taking a razor blade and going along that bevel and just scraping, you know, scrape the bevel off. That'll expose the white portion of the pit guard, part of it. And it'll look like it's got some white trim around there. I thought seriously about doing that. In fact, I did it a little bit right there just to see what it would look like. This is going to set up again the next, so you're not going to see that. Now, I really don't like the way it looks. I didn't do a real good job on that. I just scraped it down until I could see white. Yeah, I think you can see that. And uh, I need to clean, wipe it off. It's got crap all the dust on it now. It's not in the paint. The paint is perfect, man. As you can see there. But I'm, I think I'm going to, I think I talked myself out of scraping that bevel off. I mean, I just, I don't think I would like it. And if I didn't like it, I'd have to paint the whole thing again, you know. If I don't like the black, however, I can pull it back off of there, get a razor blade, and, you know, do that. If I think I would like it better later on. So I'm not going to do it right now. I'll tell you what I am going to do. I'm going to loosen all the strings on the guitar. Now I'll bring you over here and we'll put this puppy on and have a look at it, see what it looks like. So hold on, let's get right into it immediately hereafter. <laughs> hold on. So loosen the strings up so now I can uh, hopefully this will work. Lift them up. Feed the pick guard under there. And get him into place here. I don't want to handle that very much because I know it's going to make fingerprints all over it. Yeah, it's going to look way better, I think, than that white. I cleaned that all up underneath the pick guard, too, and cleaned the back of the pick guard up. And I thought I would just make a short video. I've been kicking around two or three days, man, whether I'm going to. Uh, scrape that bevel or not and we've been having crappy weather here it's been bad cold so I uh, had one day it was like 70 degrees and that was the day I chose to paint this had to do it outside I didn't want to do it in here so had one day to paint it I think I put ended up putting like eight coats on it I think <laughs> like I say it's been what, a week or more, I've been kicking this idea around of whether or not to scrape the bevel off and expose the white. I'll go back over this in a minute and tighten all these up. Right now, I just want to get them in there. And, yeah, you know, my thoughts were, if I don't like the white, I mean, all it would be was right around the outer edge would be a thin white line. It'd be, it'd be as thick as that bevel is. And if I don't like it, if I do that and I don't like it, then I, the only other option I have is to jerk the thing back off, <laughs> boogity bop, and spray it again. This way I can play it a while and, uh, you know, see if I'm going to like it or not, just leaving it completely, totally black like it is right now. So far I'm liking it a lot. But we'll see. And, you know, there again, I don't know how well this paint's going to stick to that. It may wear off as I play the thing tonight, you know. I just don't know how long it's going to last. I didn't spray any clear over it. I started to spray a, a coat of clear over the, the black, but I didn't want that glossy look, man. I, I didn't want that. That's why I bought flat black paint, satin or whatever you want to call it. So anyways, it's a done deal, folks. It's on there. It is done. And for right now, I just want to play the guitar. I haven't even been playing it much since I took the pick guard off of it and did the setup. I just want to play the thing a little bit, you know what I mean? 
Hope all you guys are doing well. Things are finally, finally, I shouldn't even say this because it probably change everything, but things are finally getting back on track here with my mom. She's doing a little bit better. Well, she's doing quite a bit better, actually. But, you know, that dementia shit, man, you just don't get over that. I mean, that's not something that's just going to go away. Now I'll start snugging these up. Don't want them tight. I just want them snug. And that's pretty good right there. Watch me slip with the screwdriver. Like I say, I don't know, man. It might... It may just rub off the very first time I play the thing. Who knows? The paint was... Uh, specifically designed for plastic so I guess we'll find out I don't want to crack the thing or split it that's very easy to do with these screws and there we are wow I like it man let me wipe it off and uh, reset everything here and I'll show it to you Hold on. Are you ready? Are you ready? I should have did a before and after so we could compare, you know, just stick them up right here. Yeah, you can go back and watch the old videos, I guess. See what it looked like before. Definitely, definitely, definitely better, I think. I, I know I like it better myself. You get some of the fingerprints off of it. And uh, let's have a look. There she is. I haven't tuned it back up yet. Don't that look a lot better, man, than that great big giant white pick guard that was on it before? See, it's still kind of glossy. I really didn't want that glossy look. That's why I didn't spray a clear coat over it. But that just looks so good, man. Check it out. Looks like a totally different guitar. Uh, like I say, this is just a short video. I wanted to update you guys on what was going on. I'm telling you what, it looks good from every angle. Look at it, man. Ten times better. Way, way more better. Check that out. Uh, just wanted to do a quick update, you know. Fill you all in on what was going on here. And, uh, like I say, I might take it off. If the paint doesn't just wear off. Might take the thing off later on and and do that do that bevel I was talking about go around the bevel and scrape it off white. And who knows? Maybe even put a clear coat on the whole thing. Then I don't know. We'll see what happens then. Let's see what it, if it sounds any better. It's prettier. Let's see if it sounds any prettier. Hold on. <laughs>